Hi guys, how's it going? Matt Tomato right here. Hope you're well. Thank you for tuning in and welcome back to some more The Sims Deluxe. So we are playing with The Sims Deluxe here and we are about to go for a renovation project here on the house. Uh, well, small renovation anyway. And uh, well, um, we have a nice pot of money here. Bella Goth still has her secret affair going, uh, which is good. But we are going to start by selling this. Uh, we're then going to go ahead and we're going to move everything in by one here. And that's going to be the wall. And we're going to get rid of that. And then we're going to drop downstairs. And we're going to do exactly the same here. So I'm going to keep these windows, but I'm just going to move them over here for the moment. There we go. And just finish the house there. Get rid of that. And put these windows back here. There we go. Oh, I don't have any windows here, that's true. See, I could just get rid of this bit here and... Well, it's kind of characteristic, isn't it? It's a little bit... Yeah, it's a bit more characteristic, so I'm just going to leave that there. Uh, so that's fine. Okay, so in terms of wallpaper then... Um... There we go, fill that in. Uh, I also need to fill in the wallpaper on the inside there. There we go. And we need to do the same upstairs. There we go. Excellent. Okay, so uh, we're going to head back downstairs here, drop the walls, and actually, um, I'm going to get rid of one of these windows, move that there, and put a door next to it there. In fact, I'm just going to get rid of that. Um, that there actually. That might be quite good. So I'll put that there. So this is going to be the door for the outside. Uh, and I'm going to put in a... Can I not build a door there? I can't have two, uh, two door frames next to each other. Really? In which case, I'm just thinking about opening that up. But no, I don't, I don't think we'll do that. So, what if I move... Oh, no, I think I know the reason why. You can't put... There we go. That's better. Let's move that there. Uh, I've just noticed there's actually a window there. How long have that been there for, I don't know. Um, let's go ahead and sell that. We don't need that there. Uh, so, with that then... <clears throat> Uh, I've sorted the floor, that's fine, so it's an open plan area that goes through that way. So then what we can do is we can change this up. So we can say, well, do this. Like that. Although I'm tempted to actually shorten the table. This is nicer. That's really good. Uh, I'm tempted to make it a smaller table. Yeah. Um, we're going to sell that one. We're going to do that. And make it four people like that. And then what we're going to do is have... So we've got a space there to eat. And then we're going to have two extensions there where we put in the barbecue and the bar and that should be quite good I'm very tempted to go with a small swimming pool at the bottom here very very tempted uh, just out of curiosity see we can do that
Oh, there's a, um, yeah. But I'm quite tempted to go with a small swimming pool at the bottom here. In which case... I'm trying to think, because we could have a bigger swimming pool. In which case we could move stuff over. But I want this to be convenient. And we could decorate this as well, like we could have... Something like that. We can make that into like a proper end space. We just decorate that. Maybe we won't go with the swimming pool. Or, actually, we could extend the fence out that way. Put the swimming pool in the corner over there. That's better. Prefer that. So then what we could do is then head into appliances and we can have the barbecue basically just out here. Pretty much something like that. So we could um, fence that off at the back there have this as like a private space to sit out in and then there's the other door out here which leads to the swimming pool but then we could have maybe a gap or something so we could have a couple of gaps where we can hit the end here actually like something a little bit like that so we could just have a couple of gaps eh, see that doesn't look right does it no, I prefer this. Where we just get rid of that and we can have a couple of open areas that we can walk out into and do different things. So that's better. And then obviously in miscellaneous we have the bar. So we shove that in there. And maybe just for the purposes have a little bin next to it. So you can sit out there, you got the bar, you got the barbecue, you can throw a party and it'll all be really freaking awesome. You know, you can have a few people out there. I reckon that'd be that'd be pretty nice. Okay, so we'll do that. Uh, I'll keep that there, and then what we could do is uh, what we'll think we'll then look to invest in. Actually, let's invest in some paintings in this room. Uh, not the clown. Uh, never get the clown picture. Um, what's this one? Maybe the watercolour as well. Um, something like that, I don't know, just to make it a little bit more roomy in there, some pictures. Uh, we should consider doing that for maybe a couple of the other rooms as well, like maybe in the bedroom we should have a picture of some sort. Crazy picture of a cat. Yeah, sure. Um, or out here, maybe even. Actually, that's quite good. Um, so we can have a picture on the wall over there. And then we could have other things. We could have other pictures. Uh, maybe let's get that tiger one again. No, that's fine. Let's go with that. And we can put some plants. Uh, what's that, 90? Yeah, see, I wouldn't mind just putting in a couple of plants in here or something like that in these two corners just to make it look a little bit nicer. And then maybe a rug there or something like that um, to sort of compensate for the idea that that's a big space and there's currently nothing in it and it looks a bit weird. So, uh, and obviously we do need to paint the outside of the house as well at the, the top here. Uh, I need to paint this outdoor basically this entire outdoor area. Okay, so that's the uh, the renovation project then. So... 
Right, you're changing to PJs, you're going to sleep. Right, so let's check out... Uh, oh, you're already uh, changed. So let's check out uh, what he needs for careers. Okay, so he needs six family friends, but uh, that's going to be impossible. So these two have both reached the point where they can no longer get promoted viably uh, without adding extra people to the, uh, to the place. So at this point, then, we have to ask ourselves whether it's worth continuing. And I think we will continue for a couple more episodes. We'll develop the house a little bit more. And then we will see where we're at, where we're at basically, and what sort of progress we're going to have here. Um, okay, so let's go. So both of them need to go to work. Cool. Okay, and of course we can we can take a day off work, and we could grill some stuff. We could do that with um, with our secret relationship here. We could do that. Uh, that's quite a thing. So her cooking skill, yeah, maybe not so good actually. Her cooking skill isn't great. Uh, so make the beds. Go downstairs. Oh, we need to get the kitchen unit sorted as well. Excellent. So we can come sit out here, and that's quite nice, I think. So Jimmy, use. Take a shower. Uh, you clean up everything else. Take a bath. Use. Uh, when you're done with the shower. We did repair that. That's good. Uh, change for work. Come downstairs. Turn on some TV. Oh, we need to get rid of those as well at some point. Change for work. Do it the other way around, actually. Come get rid of those. So change work, spray, and then, ooh, your comfort level's okay, so let's go paint. Okay, who did that? Go clean that up. Go watch some television. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, cool. So, uh, let's just wait for her to... Good. Are you bored already? Jesus Christ, that was quick. So what do you need? Body and creativity. Well, I've burned through some energy, but let's do it. Cool, okay. Right, she needs to stop as well. Give him a hug. Excellent. There we go. Lovely. We have some bills to pay, so... Uh, when you get home, get the mail. Uh, it's going to be Jimmy that comes home first, though, so... Sort of rotate around here, because she goes from 9 till 4, so Jimmy's going to be the one who comes home first. Uh, look at that car! Oh my god. It's amazing. Um... Do it the other way around. Brilliant car. Alright, and she'll be home pretty quick here. Oh, he is asleep. Okay. There we go. 400. Excellent. Good monies. Right, let's... Um, 265. The bills are roughly the same, which is great. Change the PJs and sleep. Keep the secret fair going, or work on the monies? Keep the secret affair going. Let's invite her around. Uh, she does need to get Cassandra back, though. Um, needs to invite her over at some point. Right, up you get. Have breakfast. How many of these things have we got here? Seriously. Because the problem with having two toilets, you have to keep going around and clean them all. Uh, have breakfast, then go... Use clean, take a shower, clean up. Change for work. Clean, flush. Oh, we've got enough uh, tasks already. There we go. 
Excellent, got rid of all those things. Uh, wash your hands. And then come and turn on the TV. Uh, actually, no, uh, let's do some chess. Right, Bella, you can get up and make all the beds. Uh, take a bath. Is she gonna... No, she didn't make a mess, good. Uh, use the toilet as well, probably. Probably clean it as well. Yeah, she did go wash her hands, good. Okay, uh, excellent. Come down here. Uh, actually, water these plants, then go here. Call your secret lover. Absolutely, we have so much to catch up on. Okay, we won't go with the grill though just yet. I don't think she's in the uh, good cooking position to be able to use that. He could do it, but uh, not her. Oh, here she is. She's bought flowers. Go greet. Shut up. Go greet her, for God's sake. Hey, he's sat in the car and he's like, who the hell's this woman? Oh, it must be one of her friends. Okay, blah, 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 blah. Why did she sit down? What the... Oh, okay. Goes to the toilet first this time. Interesting. She didn't even eat. If she eats now... Yeah, right. <laughs> oh, Christ! I forgot! He comes home at 3 o'clock now! Crudder! Uh, so we're not going to be able to do the uh, do the fun here. Because he'll catch them. <gasps> Is it time for the secret affair? Is it time for the secret affair to be revealed? Maybe it should be. Maybe we should make it so he actually catches them. I think we should do that. You know, uh, come and turn on the television. Come on. Right, you're bored as hell as well. Maybe it's time. Maybe it's time that they were caught. We should do that. I think it's time. He, he needs to come home from work and he needs to find that uh, these two are together. I think we could do it though. I reckon we could do it. Like we could, we could specifically make it happen as well. So how about we get him to come out here? He'll see the flowers. <laughs> I don't know whether we could. Uh... I can't see it now. Right, let's go to the toilet. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go, right. Oh, no! She's not in a good enough mood. So he's going to see the flowers. Call over. Uh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I want to get this right. He's going to be like, what the fuck? Okay, he's going to come in here. I need him to walk in at the exact moment. You ready? Now. He doesn't care. There we go. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Hey, he's found out. Oh Christ, he's found out. What the heck? Really, really angry. What the hell? Um, Jesus. No, there's no um. Ah, no, he's found out. That's the end. Hey, he knows now. God damn it. Uh, try to talk about it. <laughs> Please, no. When 
No, no. That's it. He's had it. He's annoyed. Uh, we need to do stuff that uh, we need to do stuff now that uh, basically annoys him. Uh, we're going to see whether maybe we can cause this relationship to break down. Um, and it's going to be like, oh no, what's going to happen? <laughs> but now he knows about it, so that's it now. Um, they're like, ooh, enemies, Jesus. Okay. So no, um, he's in a really garbage mood. No, it's not that bad. Um, like I need him to be in a bad mood so that maybe she can try and kiss him when... I don't know whether this is... Oh, it has done, damn it. Um, but he needs to be in like a really bad mood. So they've repaired it, but yeah, no, it's it's not going to happen. We're going we're gonna to try and get this relationship to deteriorate now, I think. I think this marriage is about to break down. So, um... Oh, apparently he likes that. Okay. Um, so we're going to wait until, like, he's in a pretty foul mood. And we're just going to let this deteriorate. And so it's it's going to get worse over time. Oh, she needs the toilet as well. Christ. Um, yeah, go to the toilet. Serve breakfast. <laughs> she just about made it. Bloody hell. Right. Okie doke. So, he has now found out about the secret affair. It is exposed. So, uh, we shall now find out whether we can get this relationship to just deteriorate. So, it's funny how it didn't impact the relationship with her at all. I'm curious here. Um, she's in a good mood. Yeah, I don't know. How are we gonna how are we gonna do this? Because they need to do stuff that like they hate each other. They need to do stuff that doesn't work. So maybe we'll just let the relationship decline over time. Because they're both in okay moods at the moment, so So Take a shower. You clean everything up here. Excellent. Uh, come take a bath. Uh, actually, no. Use. Clean. Take a bath. Change for work. And then... Yeah, sure. Come and paint. Carry on with your painting. Okay, so he's now found out. So, can we get... Um, can we get these two to argue or something? Thinking about ruining his fun here. Getting him in a bad mood. So basically, come down here. Uh, no, 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 don't do that. Uh, change for work. I'm going to try and wreck his fun meter. So he's going to be in a bad mood. So obviously it's going to impact on his career. But I need him to be quite depressed. And then I need what I need is for her to then try to go in and kiss him when he's depressed. And that, that wrecks it. That absolutely wrecks it. Um, so that's what I need to do. Okay, excellent. Oh, she's finished her painting. Cool. Okay, three dollars. Sure. Uh, come out here, recycle the paper. You start. Right, so you're not quite in a bad mood just yet, but you will be when you come home from work. And I think that's going to be the point where we, we need to try and get these two to try and kiss. Which obviously will fail, but we're deliberately doing it. Because now that he's found out about the affair, he's, he's kind of had it with her. And, um, right, recycle, change to PJs, sit out here. And then you need to change to PJs when you get home. We're going we're gonna to attempt to ruin this now. L lovely car. Yeah, he's, he's now at the point where he's sort of, ugh. You know, he's not in a good mood here. Oh, there's the bills lady. Okay, we might as well pay them. Right, she's not in so much of a good mood herself. Well, she's not too bad, but he's like in the worst. Okay, so come up here. Change the PJs. 
Okay, he's negative now. So now we can try and kiss him and that will annoy him. That will actually annoy him, I'm pretty sure, because he's in a bad mood. There we go. There, I'm not having you. You had an affair with her. I'm mad at you. Keep going. Yeah, no, I don't love you anymore. This is ridiculous. Get out. Get out of here. You had an affair. I'm going to go sleep and you're going to get out. So you're going to now be confined to the couch. She's the one who had the affair. So that's it. Okay, so they don't love each other anymore and it's just going to continue. We're basically just going to keep going like that, and we're going to get this relationship wrecked. We're going to get it absolutely destroyed here. So, she she's now confined to the couch because she had the affair. Um, she's a bad person. Her sleep's going to be bad. It's going to be terrible. It honestly is. It's going to be so bad. So, it's going to get to the point... Where... Right, we'll operate at slow speed for the moment. Uh, I'm actually going to make it so they don't make breakfast for each other anymore. It's more expensive, but they don't make breakfast for each other. So... Okay, so you're going to do that. Then you're going to come upstairs. You're going to use, you're going to flush, you're going to clean, you're going to take a bath. You're going to change for work. Right, she's going to wake up now. Have breakfast. But they're not going to talk to each other because they're eating at separate uh, separate points here. Actually, I think it costs the same. It's $10. It was $20 to serve one up. So, yeah. costs exactly the same. So, we're going to satisfy all of his needs except fun for the moment. Because we're going to get them to deteriorate their relationship. Okay, good guy. Well done. Right, yeah, she's going to spray that. Excellent. Uh, we'll get him... We'll get her to walk in... Up here. When he's having a bath. We're going to wreck this relationship. Oh, unless... No, not going to be able to. Uh, or actually, no, we'll get... I know what to do. Get him to walk in. Or rather, go clean that up. <laughs> Come and sit down here. She's not happy. Um, big shower. Change for work. Come down here. His career might go down the pan um, if we do this, but that's that's what happens in life, though, isn't it? Okay, so carpool, carpool. Try to kiss him. <laughs> I can't believe you did it. Uh, right. Oh gosh, he, he likes it. No, okay. Uh, so let's all come out here. He's in, he's in such a bad mood. The point is, oh, she loves him again, for God's sake, but yeah. It's not great. Damn it. Okay. So, once again, uh, so he's going to be home first. So, again, we'll do the same thing. Change the PJs. And sit here. And then when you're home, you can come up here and we'll do exactly the same thing again. Oh, actually. Um, pause. Pause. Go answer that. That could be interesting. Uh, oh yeah, right, right. Who's in a who's in the worst mood here? She's in a good mood. He's in a bad mood. 
No, we can't really... Maybe we can get them, just get them to try and climb into bed with each other. Uh, when they... French are like plants. <sighs> She's in a bad mood as well. We're deliberately doing this. Because <laughs> he doesn't love her. Oh, really? Wow, they will sleep together. Christ. That's amazing. I'm surprised that they will. Because he loves her. Oh, but she doesn't love him. That's it. Right. Okay, so, um, have breakfast. He is so pissed off. Can he try and... No. Right, make all the beds. Uh, come down here and have breakfast. Just need it to just deteriorate. So I think what we're going to do is we're not going to sleep in the same room. We're just not going to talk. Uh, we're going to allow it to deteriorate. 25, yeah. See, they just need to have no interaction with each other whatsoever. Right. Clean that up. Get rid of that as well. Then... Ooh. Yeah, he's, he's in a super bad mood. So, no, there's not a lot we can do here. So, hang on. So he needs to clean up. He needs to use, take a shower, change for work, and come here. And you need to go use, flush, and clean that. They're just not going to interact with each other, and it's just going to get worse and worse and worse over time. That's what we're going to do. Uh, because he's found out about the affair, he's not happy. They're both going to be slightly depressing. So no fun for them at all. They're, they're, they're just really, really not in with each other at the moment. Oh, she's not had a shower yet. Um... Yeah, you should probably go do that. And then change the work again. Yeah. And then... Go down here. <laughs> They're really complaining. Which I'm deliberately making... I'm deliberately doing it. You have to bear this in mind. Because I want this relationship to die. Uh, okay. Uh, yeah. So even being in the same house, it seems to just go up. Don't quite get it as to why it does. Try tickle her. That might annoy her. Yep. Tell her a joke. Oh. God damn it. Uh, entertain? Oh crap. Uh, that's helping. See, she's... God damn it. I'm trying to ruin it and I'm making it better. Uh, I'm, I'm so good at keeping things alive that I'm... <laughs> oh well, uh, we're going to have to get hit the work here. <laughs> God's sake. I'm trying to ruin this relationship and it's not happening. Thank goodness me. See, they still love each other, so it's... Right, change PJ, sleep. And we're going to force her, basically, to sleep on the couch. Because she's the one who had the affair. It's a simple as. She's the one who had the affair. And I'm going to end this episode right here. Um, so that's it for now. Thanks for watching. This has been myself, Matthew Tomato. Be sure to subscribe to follow the series. And join me next time for more The Sims Deluxe, where we're going to continue here with The Secret Affair, which is no longer a secret affair. And we're going to see whether the marriage does finally break down or not, because that's terrible he doesn't you know uh let's just resume here so or recap rather so he still loves her but she doesn't love him she loves chris so what we need to do probably to wreck it even further is we need to get bella to take another day off and uh we need him to catch them again i think it's as simple as that we need him to catch them again 
and uh, we'll see what happens. So maybe we can try and get them actually get him to actually catch them in bed. That'd be good. If we could do that. That'd be perfect. That's for now. Though. Cheers for watching, guys. Be sure to subscribe, to follow, and join me next time for more for myself. Matthew Zamato. See you later, guys.